Hello friends, welcome to 7th video of C programming. In this video, we are going to see the difference between the loops. In the previous videos, we had discussed something about different loops like for loop, while loop and do while loop. Loops are basically used to execute the statements repeatedly. Now let's see the difference between these two or these loops, which will help you to make a better choice for the loops, like which loop to be used. So if you look at this table, you will get the differences and this will help you to select the appropriate loop while coding. So for loop is used when you know exact number of repetitions. Like I want to print hello world message 10 times. So here we know how many times we want to iterate. So we will use the for loop. While loop and do while loop is generally used when you don't know exact number of repetitions and the repetition depends on some condition. So we can go for while loop and do while loop. Now while loop is also called as preconditioned loop. That means condition is tested first and the loop statements are executed if the condition is true. In case of do while loop, it is also called as post conditioned loop. That means the loop statements are executed first and then the condition is tested. If condition is true, again it will go to do and the loop will continue. What will happen if the condition is initially false? In case of while loop, the loop statements are not executed because it checks the condition and when the check when this condition is false, it will come out of the loop. But in case of do while loop, if initially condition is false, it will execute the loop statements and then it will check the condition. That means though the condition is false, the loop statements are executed at least once. So when you want to execute the statement at least once, regardless of condition or if the condition is false, we'll go for do while loop. When you want to execute the statements only if the condition is true, then we'll go for while loop. If you look at the syntax for these loops, so in case of for loop, there are three sections available. First is initialization, second is condition and third is increment or decrement. In case of while loop, you specify the condition as it is a precondition loop. Here you specify the condition and then if the condition is true, then only statements are executed. In case of do while loop, here it will execute the statement first and then it will check the condition. So here you can see if this condition is true, then only statements are executed. Otherwise, no. In this case, statements are executed and then condition is tested. So if this condition is false, though the statements are executed at least once. Okay, so definitely I think this will clearly specifies which loop to be used. Thank you very much for watching the video and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Thank you.